putting hogs on the mob, planting purple seeds. Baltimore Ravens coat, purple trim, big body, old school for low. Purple rim, 77 cutty, black with the purple strip. What's good, Ravens fam? I, I can't even. <laughs> I'm just not seeing this. I can't even. I can't even say say it with so much passion because what just happened that was trash. Like we was cooking first half. Man, we was cooking. And then we just like laid a goose egg in the second half. I don't I don't even know y'all just like what? I have so much frustration with this team right now. I was saying it in my in on my stream. It was trip. Even my stream was like acting ridiculous, crazy. That should have let us know right there. But man, like really. You had, you could have had your foot on their throats and you still are playing conservative right off the back. Like they gave up. No. Like in Har John Harbaugh teams always do that. It's like he's caring about their feelings. They get paid millions of dollars just like you do. Keep scoring until they stop you. But let's get to the stats. Let's get to the stats. Okay, let me pull this up. And check this out. Before I pull this out, look what ESPN did. Because they know we laid a goose egg in the second half. Like, we didn't even score points. Look at that. That right there, that says zero. That says Ravens zero. Because they even know we play like trash. In the second half. Ridiculous. Let me go with the good first. Before I get to the bad. The good. Lamar Jackson. One, 300. My apologies. 318 yards. I'm not going to talk about his rushing. It shouldn't even cost for that, but he got a TD with that, okay? The receiving, Rashad Bateman, four receptions, 108 yards, killing it. He was killing it. Mark Andrews, he had a drop. I think he had maybe two drops. Yes, he had two drops. Nine receptions, 104 yards. A TD, not bad. Isaiah Likely, he really had two drops, but 43 yards. I feel like they kept trying to force when it, when it wasn't his turn, like when his time. And he dropped a critical. He dropped a critical. He hit him in the hands, he dropped it. Devin DuVernay, you did your thing. I have no problems. 100% catch radius. Demarcus Robinson. He had one reception, 12 yards, and that reception was a TD. Lamar was doing his thing. To me, offense was doing his thing for his passing. Now, if we look at, if we look at, hold on, let me make sure I have this correct up. Uh, I hit the wrong button, y'all. Now, if we look at rushing yards, Lamar, has 119 rushing yards. 119 rushing yards. And let, let me matter of fact, let me zoom in on this. Look at this. 119 rushing yards. Second just Justice Hill. Three carry 16 yards. I'm not tripping off that. Justice Hill, to me, he played the best out of the running backs once again. Drake, which they just signed, six carries, eight yards. Six carries, 
eight yards. Perry Core got one carry, five yards. And that one carry was a fourth and one, I believe. Or a third and one. And he got five yards out of that. And we didn't see Pat Ricard no more for as these fourth and ones go. He kept Mark did Davis. He kept Greg Roman kept giving it to Davis on a fourth and one and all of this stuff. Like you just got to get Pat Ricard literally just got through on these one yards. Give it to Pat Ricard. Pancake Pat. He's not nicknamed Pancake Pat for no reason. But no, you won't keep giving it to Davis. Like, you're so determined. And really, after right now, I really believe, it just came to my head, I really believe he was trying to feed Davis so much at that time because J.K. is coming back and they trying to determine who they're going to release. Drake or Davis? Obviously, it's Davis. Gus comes back. Obviously, it's Drake. It's not that hard. It's not that hard. Okay, then let's let's scroll some more. Okay. That was the good. One good on defense. I only really have one good on defense. $70 million. Marcus Williams. He led the team. Let me put a stat up. Let me put a stat up. He lead the team in tackles once again. Two interceptions. Could have had three. Two interceptions. The Marlon Humphrey. Good. Marlon Humphrey. Ends up getting hurt. I I, ain't, I was like, where is 44? Because that's when Tyreek and everything started going off. And now, obviously, you can tell I'm going to the bad. Because as soon as Marlon Humphrey left, it started going downhill. And that right there was the beginning of a massacre. <laughs> That right there was the beginning of a massacre because it was starting. No pass rush. Oway was nowhere to be found. But I did see Oway for some weird reason in a lot, lot of pass coverage. He wasn't rushing. He should only be rushing. No if, ands, or but. He should only be rushing. Okay. Then, the one of the most terrible things was our rookies. Uh, Omar Davis. He was doing decent at first until they started putting him on the main, I believe he was on Tyreek Hill for some weird reason. Coetto, and I give props to the Dolphins for seeing this because Marlon was out. Weddle, MP Juice Man. MP Juice Man, some people I know they're going to say he gave up that touchdown. On that, I believe that was Hamilton. First one giving up to Hill. Because Ham is with no one over. Hamilton is a safety. Am I correct? Then Amor Davis got done in by Hill. And then I'm like, where is the safety help? This is a rookie on a freaking Pro Bowl wide receiver with ridiculous speed. Where is the safety help? Then I see 14 trailing once again and even Marcus Williams was looking at Hamilton was like what the 
Even Omar Davis was looking at him like, dude, what? And he's sitting there like, what are you doing pointing backwards for? Dude, you are the safety. You supposed to be in the back. Really? They scored 28 points in one quarter. Fourth quarter. Defense was getting cooked. And it seems like it just all fell apart. Everything seems to be happening on the left side of the field. It's like they knew. They was like, we finna pick on these rookies. Marlon Humphrey's not there anymore. Marlon Humphrey was doing pretty good. I think they said at the time, Tyreek Hill only had like six receptions or something like that. He wasn't going off. And as soon as Marlon Humphrey went out, it was a wrap. And Marlon Humphrey wasn't even playing. He was playing 50% because they're growing. But it got too bad. They took him out. Which I'm cool with that. But if you're going to take him out, don't do like that you, you, you were doing last year with Wick as the coordinator, leaving these stragglers on the end with no help. But on top of that, Kyle Hamilton, the first round pick, it's getting toasted. Looking at and I seen somebody say this. I don't know if it was Sip to Sip to Tally coach. I don't know if it was what's that films 22. I don't know. But I was watching, they kept saying Cal Hamilton has this habit of watching the quarterback instead of watching the play. And the quarterback faking them out. No reason. No reason. But anyway, I'm off that. Terrible game. Then Harbs. Okay. 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 Harbs. Fourth and one, fourth and one, fourth and one. You don't go for it. You don't go for it. Don't go. Get your field goals, bro. You let two fourth and ones go, that could total could have been six points. You had the best kicker in the league. That six points could have helped us in the end. But Hall's not thinking about the end. He's thinking about his ego. But you're not thinking about your ego when you're not putting your foot on their throat to end it. I don't understand. So I blame this, this on... Harps, Greg Roman, terrible offensive calling. When we was up, he started playing conservative. Mike Davis runs and fourth and ones instead of just going for field goals. That's on Harps and Greg Roman. Defense. Everybody on defense except Marlon Humphrey, Marcus Peters, and Marcus Williams. Cal Hamilton gave up 14 points. Really? Like, they got to get better. You play the pass next. No excuses. You got to get better. So, y'all tell me what y'all thought. think about the game. 28 points in the fourth quarter. Hit that like. Hit that subscribe. Hit that share. Everybody stay safe. 28 points in the fourth quarter.